everyone welcome back to Genshin Impact we are gonna be doing an Archon quest we're doing a new star approaches the floating palace so we're gonna make our way over no I was lying I was lying we gotta go up there anyway um bro I don't got time for that sorry look at all these crystals I could have though Oh, I said, don't do that. Don't do it. Don't do it. I was lying. I was supposed to go all the way up there. Now you guys are gonna watch me struggle climbing. Now we let's check out. Okay, this way. I don't really want to fight anybody right now, if I'm being honest. So we will climb up this tree. Oh god. Climb it this way. Oh. Oh! Okay! I, I was lying to you guys as well. I don't have any quarrels with you. It is it's just a joke. We're gonna die. Oh! There we go. We're just, we're just gonna burn and be on fire. It, it, it's fine. It's... Look! Ah! <laughs> it's fine! It's not... <laughs> it's fine! They, they've got to stop. <laughs> Sometimes... They will give up sooner or later. I swear to... I'm gonna die! <laughs> they have to quit it. <laughs> Whatever they're doing is... He died. Oh, wait, no, he did it. Okay. <laughs> That is the. <laughs> we made it up there somehow. That <laughs> that's pretty high up. Uh, <laughs> what? Uh, this is bad. Paimon's supposed to be your guide, but Paimon doesn't know where the way up to the Jade Chamber is. Uh, you're only realizing that now. We should ask the emissary a gun. You there you go. <gasps> Well, since we want to go to the Jade Chamber, heading to its location on the map is the sensible thing to do. Yeah. Let's look around. There has to be a way up there nearby. I'm pretty sure I know how to get up there. Uh, let's switch him out because he is dying. Oh, really? Hey, look! There's some sort of mechanism thing. Paimon, you act like you've never seen one of these. We've seen 45,000 of them. this is the right place, it must have something to do with the Jade Chamber. There's a way to the Jade Chamber. Yes, this must be the way. Mm-hmm. Oh. Oh, okay, um... I guess we'll take out Jean Lee because uh, he is half dead. So gross! It's your time to shine, girl. I want girl. to help. She wants to help. You can help by blowing on this. Thank you. Whoa. Okay, I didn't expect to go this high up, but that's fine. Old boy is still mad that we were near him. That's fine. Best we go back to Liyue and ask the Millet. Huh? Why? The way up shouldn't be a secret or... or... Oh, Paimon gets it! If it was a secret, Ganyu wouldn't have let us try to find it ourselves, right? Alright, let's follow your plan. Then we can... Oh, hang on a moment. Look down there. Looks like we've gotten close to the Guizhong Ballista. Mm-hmm. Uh, Paimon has a new idea! What? Why don't we shoot you up to the Jade Chamber using the ballista? No, thank you. Oh, right. This method does seem a bit unsafe. Paimon actually tries to murder us, I think. 
Still, I do remember the ballista had a scope. Oh, that's right. I know where to now go. Now you mention it, we <laughs> could use the Guizhong Ballista to see if there's another way up nearby. I guess we can. There's one of these. One of these duty dads here. Um, where is it? It is... Look at the palace. Over there. The way I'm looking. On the side step. And I assume that since it's on the ground, it just floats up. And that's how you get there. But we'll do the roundabout way as always. Who's that old boy? He wants to fight and I don't. Absolutely not. So we'll, uh, we'll just uh, grab on here. And we'll just make our way around. No need to disturb him. He looks like he's asleep anyway. It's, you see, it's dark out and he wants to take a nap. We don't need to disturb him. He's sleepy. We're just being good, friendly people. So it's not even there on my screen. It's, someone stole it. Okay, there it popped in. What do y'all want? The middle of her here. Halt! Yes? Who trespasses on these hallowed grounds? Hold, hold, what now? These are, uh, we're just passing through. Exactly. What are you talking about? We're invited guests. What makes you think you can treat us like this? No. Wait, maybe this was Ning Wan's plan all along. She pretended to invite us to the Jade Chamber, but set up a megalith ambush here to arrest us. Chill out. I'm quite sure that's not the case. Uh, now Paimon's mad! Paimon, shut you, up! over there! This is a trick, isn't it? How shameless! What? We're just on guard duty. What do you mean, shameless? What nonsense! Seize these suspicious intruders at once! I assume well, the other guy looks like here him. here they come! Line them up and knock them down! Paimon, none of this would happen if you didn't overreact and act like a dummy. <laughs> Well, that's fine. First point. Now we gotta fucking kill people. Well, he's off the map. Can you guys use the stairs to come back up? Or did you respawn? You respawned. Okay. Let go! Come over here. Come over here. Away from... <laughs> we'll go this way so we don't kill him. Who goes there? Me! Attack! It's me! Your man. We are a great undertaking. Y'all really out here. Everybody, stand back. Off we go. Take this. Wow. Stop. Oh, the, but he's just a baby. Don't do that to him. Take the target alive. This man, get down! Attack! Let the triad! Okay. Stop. What's all this about? Yeah, why are we beating the shit out of them? 
Lady Kuching. Cause fuck. These two strange people men suddenly appeared. Pissed. They seem to have designs on the Guizhong Ballista. Who are you calling strange? You. We're just looking for the way to the Jade Chamber. You want to go to the Jade Chamber? Wow, it's Kuching. Who are you? Kuching. I don't know. We're well, invited guests here to look for the Lira Chising. Who are you? Hmm. Well, as it happens, I am one of the Li Yue Qixing. Oh. I'm Kuching, the Yuhung of the Qixing. I know of you, Traveler. You're Ningguang's guests, yes? Didn't expect me. to meet you here in the mountains. Well, hello. Wow. Nice to meet you. Paimon didn't think we'd meet some super rich big shot out here in the middle of nowhere either. <laughs> the Guizhong Ballista in Tianhong Pass has long been in disrepair. And yet, it was fixed in a single night. I came here to investigate that occurrence. These Millilith are just here to guard the scene, not to arrest anyone. So, this was all a misunderstanding? Paimon never would have thought. Thinking isn't that hard, Paimon. Anyway, for a mortal to be able to repair an Adepti mechanism is quite the mystery. Why do you think I'm a Even mortal? Even to the Qixing. Hmm? <sighs> Paimon, don't complicate the matter, as always. Oh, right. So, Lady Yuhang, might you have any idea why Lady Tianquan invited us to go to the Jade Chamber? Just call me Kuching. I'd say that Ningguang's purpose is to request that the savior of Mondstadt take a more neutral stance. Or at least, to not wholly side with the Adepti. We're not taking sides. We spoke with the Adepti. They want to protect Liu as well. When you say protect, you're referring to their sanctimonious arrogance, aren't you? Oh! Huh? You are mortals and thus under their protection. There was no way they would have regarded you as someone with the ability to assassinate a god. Naturally, they would also regard Ningguang's locking down the area, questioning the citizenry, and pursuit of the assassin to be pointless work. Perhaps they even wonder if there might be a cover-up. Mm -hmm. I'll say it like it is. They're underestimating us. Oh. Well, you've got a point there. Still, this is the first time Paimon's seen a person from Liyue who doesn't respect the gods or the Adepti. Right? <laughs> Should I respect the shallow sense of time and condescension to mortals that has caused oh. them to delay in moving against us, Qixing? Forget it. I shouldn't speak of them this way. This skepticism is mine alone, and Ningguang does not share it. Either way, I will admit that the it actions of the Adepti this time disappears. were quite restrained. Rex Lapis's death is indeed an extraordinary circumstance. Mm -hmm. But to think that they would call for a council of Adepti rather than come down here directly. How surprisingly civilized of them. Any chance you could talk it out with them? Ningguang would prefer to negotiate, wouldn't she? Well, for Ningguang... She would talk anything and everything out if she could. But I doubt we can do that here. The time of the Adepti has oh, long passed. If even the Liyu Qixing don't want to face that truth, then what future is there for Liyu? <sighs> Another super bold statement! <sighs> I'll stop here. Honestly, I hadn't intended to say so much. But you're a good listener, Traveler. You should both be off to the Jade Chamber. Don't be late now. Ningguang's schedule is packed to the gills all the way till next year. Oh. The cream of Li Yue's mercantile crop all see ascending to the Jade Chamber is the greatest honor. Each brings rich gifts as they visit, all to curry a little favor with Ningguang. Favor? Get serious. But, but wait, that's right. Greeting gifts are a staple of Leah's culture. We need to get one. Not to curry favor or anything, just to respect Leah's culture. Oh, so eager. Oh, Paimon, I wish I could get a new sidekick. All right, all right. You can decide on your greeting gift yourselves. Let me tell you how to get to the Jade Chamber first. You didn't actually have to come to Mount Tianhung. 
Go back to Liyue Harbor. Find a guide at the Yuehai Pavilion, and... Well then, may we meet again, Traveler. Oh. Okay. Well, that Yuhung may not respect the gods, but Paimon thinks she's a pretty cool person. She made a good impression on me, too. So, what should we give to Ningguang when we see her? Oh, right! Paimon dreamed of an amazing snack last night! Sugar-frosted Sugar -frosted slime! Ew! Paimon has a feeling that it would be perfect for a super-rich person like Ningguang. Why don't we go with that for a gift? So do you have a recipe? Nope. But Paimon's sure that we just need to make it with some boom shakalaka. Let's go gather ingredients! Time waits for no one, and neither will our riches. Ew, Paimon, no. Oh, Paimon. Before we do that... Where are we supposed to go? We're on the map. Over there, I guess we could just walk. I don't want to fight. I'm a peaceful person. I don't know why they all trying to have like some big altercation with me when I'm just all about the peace and love, baby, you know? Really? Not a big deal. The slimes are too cute to be fighting anyway. I don't know why they're all up on me like that. Wee! So here we are. Why are you trying to fight me? You guys are jerks. Like, just slow your roll. Ooh, right here. Look at that slime! It looks crystal clear! And very delicious. I guess. That's the one. I guess, but he's a cutie. I don't get it. How dare we? He doesn't deserve this, to be honest. And it makes me sad. He's all chunky, too. What the heck? This cutie. These fucking flies can suck on my... Uh, you know. You know. Fill in the blanks. Why is everybody... Why does everyone want to fight me? Oh. Huh? Is it just Paimon? Or is there a sweet fragrance in the air? Huh? Did you hear that? It sounds like someone's calling for help. It seems like it came from those ruins over there. Uh-oh. It looks like the treasure orders have locked someone inside. I mean, it can't be helped. I don't really... Like, it's not my responsibility There's to no save, reason. but okay. My great undertaking. I guess I will. If I must. I wonder if my level rolled up. My world leveled up, not my level rolled up. You know what I mean. Moments of birth. Chill out. Oh, down here? And then back up here. Yes, yes, yes. Those are nice at people. That is just not very nice. Wow, there's a wind current here. Wait, is that where we need to... Where Where's this go to? Have I been there? Oh man, there's an assassin guy. I really want to save this guy, but I really want to fight the assassin guy and get his shit. And here we go. I know it was all about the love and peace earlier, but like... The assassin guy. Peace and love can go to hell. Hi, buddy! Oh, you're beating the shit out of me. Stop it. Burst forth. Where'd you go? Where'd you go? I can't see without my glasses. Oh, you're over here somewhere. Where'd you go? Where'd you go? Oh, there. 
Moment of birth. We'll find you here somewhere. A miscalculation. Yeah, it was. This. Going in. Get him in the corner and just fuck him up. Just stay in this corner. Can't Thank run you. from dead. Wow, thank you so much. I needed those. You're such a sweet man. I didn't mean any of it. Red Benny, we didn't mean it. Open the cage. We definitely will. Just give me a second. Wait a minute. What are these? Extra sweet flowers. Okay. Hi, buddy. You want me? Ming da? Ming dan? Ming dan? Hi. <sighs> Thank you for your help, kind travelers. You're very welcome. If you hadn't come to my aid, I surely would have rotted in this cell. Those treasure hoarders. When their mood was good, they'd rearrange those pots of sweet flowers. When they were in a bad mood, they'd rearrange my face. Aw, oh, it was nothing. No need to thank us all at once or anything. <laughs> I understand. Don't worry. I will compensate you both. There's really no need. Oh, don't say that. I only escaped this predicament because of you. I I'm Mung Dan, a supplier Mung for Mingxing Jewelry in Liyue Harbor. Oh. I often walk around these mountains in search of antiques. I never expected that those treasure hoarders would have their eyes on the same ruins that I had. Before I knew it, they'd caught and imprisoned me. Is there anything that you lack? Uh, antiques, treasure, various knickknacks, you name it. Well, as long as you want what I have to offer, of course. Your goodwill is good enough for me, but I would take some... Never mind. Wait a moment. Actually, we are looking for something. What? Oh? And what might that be? Do you have a box that can store presents? Oh. We'd like a pretty one. The kind that you can use to store snacks. Of course we do. How can one sell antiques without gift boxes? At Mingxing Jewelry, we have the best gift wrapping service in the Seven Nations. Now just give me a moment, and I'll let the boss know. You can go see her whenever you require that box. Great! Paimon Sugar Frosted Slime now comes in a beautiful package! Sugar Frosted Slime. Disgusting. You're disgusting! I guess we will go to the jeweler, and that'll be the last thing we do in this episode. Oh, God! Who's trying to... I'm not... I didn't mean it. Whoever wants to fight, just stop. Hopefully we don't get electrocuted. I've been almost struck by lightning so many times. Oh, boy. Oh, boy. Don't do it. Don't kill me now. I'm just a pyro boy in the water. Wet. I can't do shit. But when could Benny ever actually do anything? Joking, Benny, you're, like, kind of OP, so it's fine. You may be a loser to everyone else, but you're not to me. Okay, Benny, you're a winner. You got that shit, kid. There you go. We'll get some berries while we're here, because we gotta make some jam. <laughs> Let's see. It's this walking simulator right now. Oh, we just follow the path this way. Oh, it's you. You want to fight? No. <laughs> Stop lying. I don't want to. I'm just trying to have a little fun. Walk around here. Maybe scout out some items while I'm here. I don't see anything. Now, if you were something worth fighting, that would be fine. But, alas, they're not. I don't know. I've been getting kind of over this whole quick travel thing. Uh, I just like walking. So I can get more shit. Plus, look how pretty this place is. Why wouldn't you want to walk around here? 
like in real life probably not because like you're asking too much but like in game heck yeah plus look i would have missed these blaze lilies if i quick traveled so give me and give me Whee. wow see look this dude's just chilling too hey goodbye <laughs> Wait, what? Bye. While the monolith stands guard, evil shall never prevail. Oh, also, don't steal... Sarge, I'm here. Sarge, I'm here. Oh, don't tell Sarge I'm here. If you don't see him, I said, I thought it said don't steal. I was like, wait, what? <laughs> ay, 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 ay. One of the benefits of having dyslexia. There we go. Let's take that. Blaze lilies. Oop. Found these steps. Hi! And bye. Wait a minute. While we're here, let's go to Boo Boo Pharmacy. Always getting sidetracked in these episodes. I know, I know. Hi! Please, show me your prescription. I don't have one. Like, I have no money, but, like, I need stuff. I, I need these. Oh god. Um, I need these. I really need these because I can never find these. Okay, okay. We're living the broke life. Um, do you think they take credit cards? That's a real question. Because I don't have the money. He's having the best time. See, that's what we all should be looking like. He's having the bestest time. And always stealing lotus heads from the city pond. There we go. Don't mind me. I wasn't in here. Secret UA... Oh, secretary. <sighs> UA pavilion. Okay. Hello, yes, we're here. Mm. And Benny's adventure team of one. We are here. We're here to give some important people sugar frosted slime. How disgusting. Hi! Hey there! A guy called Mung Dan told us that we could get a nice and shiny box from your store. Uncle Mung already told me about it. Thank you both for saving him. Many of the best goods in our store were found by Uncle Mung. If anything were to happen to him, it would be impossible for us to continue doing business. Here, this container is itself an antique, with at least 140 years of history. It's already been cleaned. Will it do? Yep, yep, yep! It's great! Hang on a moment. Could we borrow one other thing? Sure. Please help yourselves. As long did, as it's on our shelves. Did that sound weird to anyone else? She's like, can we borrow one other thing? It's like she had different voice like takes like sliced together. Is that what that sounded like to you? Or maybe it was just on my end. Traveler, this clay pot looks really awesome. Okay, what if about we it? use an antique as our mixing bowl, we should be able to make a great snack. You wanna... It's done! The one and only sugar frosted what? slime! Carefully now, into the box it goes and dust it over with a bit more powdered sugar. Where do we get powdered sugar oh, from? Oh, yes. You might want to use these two freshly picked flowers as decorations, too. Wow. Woohoo! It looks Oh, it's beautiful. really pretty. Sugar frosted slime. Still not sold on the gift idea. Great. Now that we've got oh, all that we've got into this box, let's go to the Jade Chamber to see Mingguang. We definitely will. We definitely will be doing that. Ice on, on the slime. But, like, can we learn the recipe for that? No. Let's look at it in our inventory real quick. There it is. Oh, this way. A truly... Exquisite sweet treat that came from a certain someone in a dream. 
This dream was made reality through someone else's hard work and, of course, a healthy dose of boom shakalaka. Surely this is a gift fit for someone who belongs to an upper echelon of society. Yes, but what about the recipe for it? That's the real question. What if I want to make it? Hmm. Well, but anyways, guys, that is gonna have to be it for this episode. In the next episode, we will <laughs> go up, up, up high to the palace. I can't see it from here. It's over this way, I think. But anyways, I hope you guys had a wonderful day, and I'll see you next time. Bye-bye.